way. We can't even take him to the fair because we don't have any money. Adelia Camarillo has to create a different experience for her children. You know, my kids think this is a vacation. This wasn't the plan for them or the nearly 250 tenants displaced in these hotels after evacuating their homes. And then these were the ones that were placed on our door at our apartment. Plans from the city to end their hotel stays. Wednesday, to the 6th, Wednesday. Wednesday. Because of the rooms already booked for this weekend. It would be an inconvenience to them, but that, that, that is kind of upsetting. Who wants to give up their room, right? Rooms that are not cheap, I checked. About 164 to check in Wednesday and leave Friday. For a Friday check-in, 400 per night at the least. I'm pretty sure they made those reservations way in advance before this happened. Before she had to leave her home, a place she is not comfortable going back to. Because something traumatic happened to us and people don't understand the, the trauma that comes and follows behind it. How are we supposed to feel safe? So she's making her own plans. Um, in the battle of trying to get out of my lease, just to move out of the apartments and start over. As thousands flock to Dallas to make memories, she thinks about how her kids will remember this. We as parents have to clean that up and explain to our kids why these things happen. Something she couldn't have planned for. In Dallas. Trying to make them happy and comfortable here. I'm Morgan Young.